So we're back. Um, still helping Sunny Spouse. Gonna get rid of some geckos. Minutes, especially with two of us. Come with me. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I would not suggest to shoot them unless you're going on a kill everything run, which I might do later. I use bats a lot to basically help me see where enemies are. Mm -hmm. I like using that uh, weather 10 millimeter, especially in the beginning. There's Three wells total, I believe. At one of them, which I think it's the next one, there's a lady that needs saving. Unless you choose to be evil, of course. Then you could always just kind of leave her there. Or kill her yourself. I never remember. Oh, that's sunny. I oh, never mind. I was like, I never remember that good spring settler on the gun. <laughs> okay. I hate when that happens. Oh no. I think she killed them all, and I was like, whoa, no way. How Holy moly. If you hadn't come here like you'd done, I'd be a goner for sure. I came up here to draw water, but here, you should have what I got. You look thirsty. Lovely. I've been accepted by the people of Good Springs. That will definitely come in handy. Now I got one more well. Always, I always take the meat usually, which I didn't hear, but of course that is now food. Now that was some good work. Here's a little spending money for the trouble. One more thing I wanted to show you. Thought I might teach you about living off the land. Okay, maybe, maybe you only work. two wells. All right then. I only suggest taking this quest to too. Want it will teach you how to craft uh, healing powder now. and you using campfires. Up at the you don't have to. And I seem to remember there being xander root over by the schoolhouse. Bring those on back to me, and we'll get cooking. Now you can go to the schoolhouse, but I found, and I think that's where I'm headed, there is Xander Root outside of this uh, Good Spring Stores place. Just kind of walk, just keep, you know, yay straight. Can't really tell what direction that is, because I am re-editing this. And the little screen I'm looking at, it's just small. It looks like north, but... Could be wrong. Northeast. Now those are uh, helpful items you can use later. I usually pick them anyway. But Xander root will be growing out of the ground. What looks like a little tiny mound with hair sticking up. Like a carrot or something. I just saw one I think behind. There's more geckos, of course. There's a Xander root right by that gecko, actually. If you can't see it in the back. So if you don't want to traipse all the way up to the, the schoolhouse, it's a good place to get Xander root. Don't know, I didn't turn around and go get that one. I guess I didn't catch it when I was originally playing. I'm like, turn around, Sierra. It's right behind you. Can't pick that one up. I was like, oh, can't pick it. <laughs> but yeah, I missed that one completely. Now, the Brock flower, I haven't found anywhere except the cemetery. Just a friendly reminder there are bloat flies, a rad scorpion or two. Just be careful going up there. <clears throat> Excuse me. 
the videos jump because I'm using the Xbox DVR and I'm sure by the time it makes its way to Facebook I mean not Facebook YouTube the quality is going to be so distorted nobody want to watch them but that was worth a go anyways I don't have a capture card or anything like that so I'm using what I got And now I'm just kind of onward up to the cemetery, which you can see on the top, you know, over the top of the hill by the water tower. Now, if you don't have the Vault 13 Canteen, now that I'm thinking about it, and you're playing on Hardcore or Survival, whatever you want to call it, um, you're going to be having to watch your water and your dehydration a lot more. Just keep that in mind. I ended up having the Caravan Pack, or, well, I ended up getting a few packs with mine, but it might have been the Mercenary Pack. One of the three or four packs has it but now right here's red scorpions I believe yeah keep in mind out for them because they will poison you it's always good in this game to keep some antivenom on you because crasadors and uh, red scorpions and some other things will poison you luckily I shot him before he touched me I didn't get it, but I thought I would note that there is your very first Good Springs uh, uh, snow blow here. And I believe it's towards the uh, blowfly in the back on one of the uh, graves. I myself have never collected all 20. I believe there's 20. No, I'm sorry. There's seven. I'll have to look that one up. I remember bobbleheads, my bad. But I myself have never collected all of them. I should just get the brock or the brock flower and get out of there. But killing them is experience. And loot. I realized in just a second I could just fast travel back to the Good Spring source. <laughs> Instead of just running unless you just want to run. And after making this, we'll conclude the tutorial, hey, that's so to bad, speak. Important. Well, I'm heading back now. No, I'm just skipping through hey, the dialogue a little bit, and I Maybe. don't plan to She's do that bar. so much in the future. Once I decide exactly where I'm going with this uh, playthrough, I will... Um, decide what faction I'm going with and 
how exactly I may branch off and do vi uh, videos of each. I've never been able to join the NCR completely. I did a, my first playthrough, which I didn't, you know, make a video for. Well, join the Legion, and it was quite interesting. But there are many options for this. Now here you talk to Trudy. You see her little competition with the powder gang or Joe Cobb. I'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. What do you want? And you can talk to him. There's some trader who decided he'd rather shoot than pay the toll for being in our terror. Would serve these idiots right if me... Let me get out of town before we talk. Too many unfriendly ears around. It is now. And then that will be covered in a minute. You can help them. Damn you busy. see that the map mark is located. Rob some people. Smart, so. Burn some things. Kill the we'll go check it out. Same old shit that's been going on for years. The NCR and Legion are still fighting over Hoover Dam for some reason. Never been there since the NCRs got tr I've run with some tough gangs. I ain't New California Republic. Nothing. They've got true. Yeah. Hey. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. Looks like our little town got itself you dragged got in the middle of something you we can don't talk have anything to, to do with. About a week ago, this trader, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't I'd actually like expect anyone to come after him. Any other Fallout game, you can go bad or good. So to speak. I generally go good. And in this playthrough, I'm probably not going to be killing everything. Cobb hasn't exactly been... He's holed up at the... You mean Murp? Some of the others... Chang... Problem is... Excuse me, skipping through. Not much, other than their of course we they were having some sound like that whole I didn't hear fellow wants to get sure there be be careful. Excellent. Now I'm increasing the repair because you can fix our radio for a repair skill of 20. I went ahead and did that. And I usually always take Black Widow. I'm usually always a female. But I take the Chervez, the Fim, or whatever afterwards. They come in handy. Alright. Now this part. Hey. Well, I go, I go see Ringo. He's held up at the gas station. Hey, partner, might I say you're looking fit as a fiddle? Bye, Victor. 
Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. I'm always too nice. I was out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. Saw what looked like a bunch of bad eggs, so I laid low. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the dock right quick. Can't say that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town might be able to help you out with that. You are a very strange robot, indeed. Right, onward. Another reason I increased my lockpick is there are two safes, one of them being inside here that you can loot. The other one being That's in the schoolhouse. Enough. Who Sorry about the gun. We got a Yeah. Straight over to the safe, which is in the floor. You have to look for it pretty good. All that stuff's pretty useful. You can loot the crates and the shelves at the gas station, but I didn't. there you can do either thing. You can go ahead and start the gunfight, which I don't suggest personally and I don't do. Or you can go help the powder gangers at first in the correctional facility. That's generally what I do. Now I'll go ahead and talk to him. He'll give you some dynamite if your explosive is at 25. Hi there, sticking around good. Say no more. Joe Cobb talk. However, if you. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere. And Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up. Easy Pete. I'll be waiting. Keep in mind, you do need an explosive skill of 25, which is what I tacked one of my Howdy. skills at the beginning. What can Easy Pete do for you? Too ding. Uh huh. Went ahead and got that out of the way. Keep your gun. I don't normally use them in the gunfight, anyways, but they're free dynamite. And I also increased my speech and barter for Shet and, uh, Trudy, excuse me, Melissa Tracy, Trudy. And then there's his help. 